was it? Uh, uh, syrup. 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 Yeah. Yes. Wow. And also he, you know, now we're in best of five territory. Um, so that's also just really exciting because I just, I personally like watching the problem solving, right? So I want to see, you know, a best of five where you see people adapt to habits and figure out like, oh, this is what I could do against this. And that's to me what makes these games really exciting. And of course, these two players are really smart. So you're going to see some awesome stuff from both sides. I would love any song other than this right now. Oh, Lumio yeah. City is such a snores fest, but I don't guess. There we go. Yes. <laughs> Thank you, Devin. There you go. <laughs> Playing that good stuff. Oh, boy. Ooh. And getting He's not going to die, but man. Th those details, man, they are insane. I mean, he could have he could have died, and then when he had to recover, he could have died again. Rob is just so threatening, man. Like, he's threatening on stage. He's threatening at the ledge. He's threatening off stage. I mean, this character is explosive, and he can just kill you at any time. Yeah, again, it's going to be a similar situation where, like, in uh, Winter Semis for Vivi here, where he's not going to be allowed much wiggle room here. You know, once Rob uh, gets those kill confirms, you are God, pretty much dead. That's got to be one of the fastest nope. turnaround down tilts I've ever seen in my life, man. This guy is auto-turnaround as a player. Like, did you <laughs> see that? He, like, whiffed a nair and then just immediately detilted Lucario off stage, and that led to that stock there. And again, like what we said earlier, oh... Beautiful back air there from uh, from Vivi. One, one of the things that we mentioned earlier is how Lucario doesn't like characters that are, you know, can close out the stocks cleanly off of like grabs and stuff. Yeah. Uh, and Rob just happens to be that guy, man. He's that dude. Shows up to the club, just grabs everybody, <laughs> and everybody's oh upset. God. You know what I mean? He's that guy. Yeah, he's definitely that guy. Um, and also having you know two really good projectiles to play around with is also going to make things uh, pretty hard for Vivi here. Again, like you mentioned, Lucario is a is a character that thrives in these you know elongated stock situations because you know you want to take advantage of rage and aura uh, at the same time. But Rob is a character that, like we mentioned, does has no problems cleaning his plate uh, whenever the uh, the kill confirms uh, come a knocking. Yeah, I don't know if uh, licking the plate is the right metaphor. These guys definitely eat glue. So you mean like, you know, render that Elmer's jar completely empty. That's what you mean. They have no problem just, doing that. I mean, unless Rob has like a zip file of Elmer's glue, he has to like unlock on his mainframe. So Zamba's failed arts and crafts his whole life, man. He just can't get past the glue. Uh, they definitely like the sparkly ones. And look at that. I mean, oh my God, dude. Dude, if Vivi is like really having to like try hard to get these back airs to really clean out these stocks, and then you see Zamba just come off the angel part, and he's like, "Dude, if I detail you, chances of you dying are extremely high." And if, if somehow you you don't miss the tech and I don't kill you off that, you're at the ledge now. I mean, this character, man, this Rob guy. Oh my God, this Rob guy, man. Yeah, Rob's a, a menace, man. Like you've seen, see these down tilts near the ledge has been hell for Vivi to get around as uh, Zamba at the ledge has been an absolute, uh, you know, no pun intended, a machine. Oh, boy. I mean, this is really, I, I, I hate to say it. I'm going to say it on the mic. I feel bad for Lucario, bro. Like, what? That's on record. I want oh everyone to know that God. is on the record. It just looked like once he starts getting hit, like, he's not, he's floaty, but also he's not, like, really small. So he's, like, a lot of the things Rob does is just, it was hard for him to not get two framed. He, VV had great awareness and mixed up his timing on recovery so that he didn't get down there at the ledge once that whole game. Yep. But then, like, that still didn't matter. He still just got destroyed in every other way. I need Glenn saying he feels bad for Lucario. Oh, uh, I, need, I need that in writing. I need that in in, in, in wave file. I need that out of context. What was Sakurai uh, thinking? Life. He's like, all right, let's take a heavy, make him a zoner, also a grappler, and then give him the best recovery in the game. Yeah. And he has kill throws. I mean, Rob is essentially just like... <laughs> and a, he's a boxer. Yeah, Rob <laughs> plays a lot like what Smash Bros. Lucario is like, where... You can't really play this character from a distance because you have projectiles that can be, you know, shot at you in a kind of force your uh, hand and approach. And playing him up close is incredibly awkward, like you said, because uh, Rob's boxing tools are very, very solid. So, you know, the only difference being that Rob's a little bit more complete of a character. Uh, but still, like we've, we've seen so far today, Zama's been playing like a man possessed as a DV. Uh, you know, already <laughs> looking a little... Uh, scuffed out here in his uh, first stock. Yeah, great recovery mix up there from Vivi. He's like, you know what? You're going to take the low road. I'm going to take the high road, buddy. And he just went right into him with that extreme speed. Oh, great call out there. Again, the, the turnarounds. I want to give Zamba credit, man. He has auto turnaround <laughs> as a player. He just did a turnaround F smash, like, just like, like that. What a great, like, what great awareness. 
To be young, man. Oh, to be yeah. Young. Yeah. For <laughs> us, our reaction time is just getting, like, worse by the minute. Yeah. Like, since I started commentating to now, like, the game is just getting faster <laughs> and faster. I can't keep up with this, man. Yeah. I get one of those maybe, like, once a month. Yeah. <laughs> But nonetheless, though, so, uh, Vivi with, uh, you know, looking down the barrel of a potential 2-0 deficit here. But that back air will be a nice, you know, way to set things up as uh, Zamba recovering high. And Lucario not really having, a, you know, great means to, you know, get to up there. To go all the way up there. Yeah, I mean, if only he could shoot his R-Sphere directly up above his head. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, one of the interesting things is, like, we're seeing that the R-Sphere is really, like, the conditioning tool, right? And then you see that most of Vivi's stocks are him calling out a jump because he knows you're afraid of him shooting the R-Sphere to landing trap you. So you'll notice he's always calling out jumps and getting back airs, but that's really how he's getting most of his stocks. And I, I'm not sure if that's enough. You know, like someone like Zamba will catch on to that. Oh boy, that gyro. Zamba getting hit by his own gyro is hilarious. <laughs> I just want to say one thing real quick. If you bought a Rob in the 80s, it came with six gyros. Yeah. Why does he have a million in this game? Like, let's just <laughs> nerf that. He should have unlimited gyro, man. That is it's too much. He should load them as slowly as the original Rob does. Dude, he should run out of batteries. This character is broken. <laughs> there should be some kind of meter that, that, like, stops him. It's called the video game strike of the 80s. So You should be able to time out the battery, man. If you can get three minutes in, one of those Duracell needs to be switched <laughs> oh mid-game. Dude, unplug this, man. I mean, batteries are canon, uh, you know, thanks to Pikmin. Oh, Ooh. wow. And that counter did not kill. Not even close. Yeah, that was uh, oddly low powered. As, uh, again, uh, Vivi having a rough uh, go of it here. Like and we said, this is best of five territory. But, man, it, it's really looking tough. I think I think if this game ends anytime soon, we're seeing the hero. It's, it's possible. You know, maybe... Uh, Maybe it changes scenarios exactly what uh, DV needs, but like, again, like we mentioned, Azama's just been all, all on him like a, you know, like a bad rash or something. Like it's not what they're yeah, I mean, it'd be great. This is the stock right here. GG, shake my robotic hand. We're going to a game three. <laughs> I was gonna say it seems offensive to call it a hand, like <laughs> my arm. Man, Our this this uh, the steel type. Can he steal the stocks? Or Oof. will he be robbed? Uh oh. I, the puns are getting worse, guys. God, I hate you. Can I get a Can I get a boo from the audience, please? <laughs> nice. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Slippy toad like that one, all right? <laughs> okay. No, it looks like Lucario will be, uh, you know, man for at least the third game here. So. You know, no hero coming out from Vivi. Probably thinking, all right, you know, if I'm, I feel like a slower, you know, uh, character like um, Hero's not really gonna do Vivi any favors here. Dude, can we talk about he? He just did. He hit him like four times, three, two, one, go, and he's just in him, right? He did 33 <laughs> percent. That is pathetic. Rob literally hits you twice, and you're at like 40. Yeah. This is why they give him the aura, cause they're like, all right, he's kind of pathetic at the beginning of the game. Yeah, that, that, I'm this sure that's exactly why. That is literally why. They're like, he's just so pathetic that they're like, all right, let's just make him late game. He's just such a monster. He's a closer. He's a closer. Oh, boy, man. And, I mean, Zama just looks so comfortable. I mean, this is one of those things where, I mean, Vivi started off pretty strong, but, I mean, the damage output is just too... You know, the thing about being one of those late, one of those characters like Lucario that it gets stronger later is that by that time, like, you have to clutch it out because... The, you've given the guy the, the stock lead the entire game. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, you're never going to have a, a, a stock lead. It's very hard for you to have, like, a big advantage Ooh. early on. And look at that. The counter did not even kill him at 130. He went straight up. Yeah, or almost straight up. That, that's, it's, it's weird. That move definitely has its utilities, but definitely has not looked impressive to both times it's connected. And that is a no stock. Way. Oh, it's not. Okay. No, but it's big damage coming up for Zamba. Oh, that was definitely supposed to be a side V. <laughs> Unless that was the most dis disrespectful laser of, of all time. Yeah, I mean, Zamba conditioning there, doing the downer again, and then he he, he meant to go off stage <laughs> and do the side V. Man, this is just getting worse and worse. I think Vivi might have... He might have wanted to go hero at this point, but who knows? I mean, it might be just as bad, so. Yeah, whatever it, uh, it is, Zama definitely has cracked the code on Lucario. Down air to the force palm, not going to be enough. Uh, 164 on Rob's tab right now. Okay, that was going to say, next solid great hit. Great call out. Yeah. yeah, great call out there from Vivi getting that up air. But, man, I mean, 
even with all this, uh, you know, aura, it's just hard for him to land. It's hard for him to get to get off the ledge. It's hard for him to recover. It's hard for him to play neutral. I don't see really where this character can even start to fight Rob. There you go. Dash Attack is going to force a high recovery from Vivi. Able to get back to the, uh, you know, center of the stage. But still, like we mentioned, is it too little too late right now for Glenn? I mean, he got that he, he, he got that grab there, and then he just didn't really have... He didn't get anything out of it. You know what I mean? I mean... You didn't get anything out of it. Sheesh. 3-0 and a successful fist a bump. Solid, right? yeah. solid, a good, solid, solid, solid. Solid. Yeah. So excellent stuff right there from Zamba advancing on into winner side of grand finals here. At uh, take a look at this replay here. Okay. What? Yeah. Uh, he, yep. Yep. That going to connect. It's going to uh, kill him. We take a look at the form <laughs> here. Look at that and solid. Look at that connection right there. Perfect, yeah. right? N not not like n knuckle on knuckle yeah, right there. You gotta make perfect, sure. Perfect, yeah. perfect, perfect little uh, fist bump there. Just, yes, yeah. You can tell they've done that many times. They've rehearsed that many times. <laughs> they probably it played should be a agreed. Times. It should be agreed upon, like in in the pre, you know, match stuff. To say, okay, I'm gonna go this character. I'm gonna ban this stage. Also, I'm gonna I'm a fist bump guy, not a handshake yeah. guy. You know, dude. Post COVID, we're all fist bump guys. If you're a handshake guy, post pandemic, you you need help. All right, <laughs> like that's just insane. I don't want to see any of this. I don't want to see any of of. of